Today, we are talking about the next community day in Pokemon Go, which features Ponita and Galarian Ponita. This event will happen on Saturday, September 14th, from 2 pm to 5 pm on your local time. During this community day, enjoy these exciting bonuses 2 times candies for catching Pokemon, 3 times Stardust for catching Pokemon. I love the events with the 3 times Stardust as a bonus. 2 times chance for trainers at level 31 and up to receive a Candy XL from catching Pokemon. Lure models and incense, excluding build incense, activated during the event will last for 3 hours. Take a few snapshots during the community day for a Ponyta encounter. One additional special trade can be made for a maximum of 2 for the day. Trades will require 50% less Stardust. Note that the trade bonuses will be active from 2 pm to 10 pm. As always, we will have will research tasks, so complete them to earn rewards like Great Balls, Ultra Balls, Finite Berries, and Stardust. You will also have a chance to encounter Ponita or a Gallery in Ponita. Keep an eye out for a special Pokestop showcase featuring Ponita. This showcase can offer a second rewards, so don't miss out. Collect and event team stickers by spinning Pokestops, opening gifts, or purchasing them from the in game shop. Two Community Day bundles will be available during this event. For 1350 pocket crunch, you will get 50 Ultra Balls, 5 Super Incubators, 1 Elite Charge TM and 5 Lucky Eggs. For 480 pocket coins, you will get 30 Ultra Balls, 1 Incense, 3 Super Incubators and 1 Lure Model. As usual, you can buy a Community Day Day Special Resource. For $1, you can buy the Ponita and Galarian Ponita Community Day Exclusive Special Resource. This $1 special resource, it's not a bad deal because you can earn incense, rocket radar, pokestop and encounters with the Pokemon of that community day. After the community day, enjoy special 4 star raids featuring Ponita and Galaria Ponita. These raids will be available from 5 pm to 10 pm. Note that you can only join these raids using passes or premium battle passes. Remote raids are not accepted. Defeating Ponita or Galarian Ponita in a 4 star raid will spawn more of the same Pokemon around the gym for 13 minutes. These additional spawns will have the same shiny rate as during the community day. The Pokemon moves that's coming from Calm Day will be wild charged. Let's dive in, in on tips and tricks. Tip number one is going to be all about cleaning your Pokemon bag. Manage your bag. Before the event, free up space in Pokemon storage. Transfer any Pokemon you don't need to make room for new catches. Aim for at least 380 slots. Let's go for tip number two. Stock up on Pokeballs. While Pony to not be a top tier for PvP or PvE, this community day is all about grinding Stardust. Catch as many Pokemon as possible, so make sure you have a plenty of Pokeballs. If you have an Auto Catcher, keep it active throughout the event. Now, tip number three, maximize spawns. Use Star Piece, Essence and Wood Models to attract more Pokemon to your location. Additionally, take advantage of the Palkia Adventure Special Rain effect to increase spawns radius and encounter more Pokemon. Tip number four, maximize your gains with Mega Pokemon. To boost your candy and XP earnings during the community day, consider to use a Mega Pokemon. Fire type or psychic type mega will provide the best bonuses. That's all for the Ponita Community Day Guide. I'm personally very excited about this event, especially because I've always loved the Triple Stardust event. Be sure to, to share your shiny Ponita encounters and any tips you have in the comments below. If you liked this video, I recommend you to check out my other Pokemon Go content. Don't forget to subscribe for more excited Pokemon content and see you in the next video.